Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today, we are celebrating my channel's, I think, second birthday. So I've been posting for two years now. Uh, I don't know when I actually started posting, but I do know that it was in October. So we're celebrating today, just like birthday parties, March. Always on your birthday. So yeah. Uh, to celebrate, I'm going to be making these delicious black bottom cupcakes. The recipe is here. It's uh, on a paper, so I'm, I'm not going to be linking anything. You can just like pause the video or something. I don't care what you do. And anyways, yeah, so we're going to be making a cake because I feel like birthday parties need cake and uh, you can't have any, so you can make your own. So yeah. Not the best image, but anyways, so you're gonna need eight ounces of cream cheese. Uh, you can just get these in a box and then dump it in. One third of a cup of sugar. One egg. And then chocolate chips. The recipe calls for six ounces. I just dump in enough that. Looks like a good enough. That looks good. And then you mix it. You also need an eighth of a teaspoon of salt. I just put in a dash. Okay, so over here we're going to be making the cake part. And for this, for that the list, we're going to need flour, sugar, salt, uh, baking soda, cocoa, and oil, vinegar, vanilla, and water. So you're going to need one and a half cups of flour. I like to use a spoon to put it in my cup thing, and I don't want to clean my half a cup, so I'm just doing two spoonfuls of this because that's about how much it takes to fill up half a cup. So, you know. And you like, it's good to use a spoon when you're scooping it, like the flour, so it's not compacted. So you scoop it and then scoop it and brush off the top. That's how I like to do it anyways. You will also need one cup of sugar. And you will also need uh, one teaspoon of salt. A little bit in there. That should be there. That's how I like to do it. Let's stir up at least. And you're also going to be needing a teaspoon of baking soda. And then we mix. You should probably use a spoon. That's a good plan. I'm going to be using this one. The little spoonful of things. Mix to your ready. You move on to like cocoa. So you need one fourth of a cup of cocoa. I do like a big old spoonful plus a little more. And that's about how much you need. This is my spoon. You should probably just measure it. I don't want to get out the tools and do it and all that yada yada. You need a third of a cup of oil. I didn't show you because I forgot to hit record. You also gonna need one teaspoon of vinegar. Is a Heinz all-purpose vinegar. As a zine to it, delicious. And also a teaspoon of vanilla. And after your teaspoon of vanilla, you put in a cup of water. I'm not going to show the water, but I'll show you how the mixture looks. So, yeah. Looks so like, and just in case you're wondering, it is delicious. I can't see all the me. But oh uh, yeah. So now we're gonna line our cupcake pans. You can also like spray it with the butter stuff. And then yeah, and make sure your oven's at 350. So next you're gonna want to take your chocolate dip and fill up your cupcake things one third of the way. I'm using this ice cream scoop to measure it out. And it looks kind of like a little Actually, too much. You'll see how it should look in a second. That might be a little more, but... 
you want to be fine. And then you take a spoon full of your cream cheese and stick it in. And I'll show you how that all looks right now. So, uh, this is what they look like. I, must, I put too much in that first one, so I try to take some out. One third is the smaller part, but you don't know. They do not, they're not the prettiest cupcake, but they taste the best. We're going to put them in the oven for 25 to 30 minutes, and then we can eat them. And this recipe makes about 24 cupcakes. So this is what my cupcake looks straight out of the oven. Here's the other ones. So, uh, have you looked into my channel? Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I like to post on Mondays. And I did post on Saturdays for a while. I might still be doing that. I don't know. I haven't really been going to YouTube lately, so I haven't. But I got a couple of boxers videos that I want to record. Let me tell you. They're not really. Yeah, like, come on, please, bye. Bye.